Hey guys, so we're going to be going over a little bit of the build going on with the 2003 the VGT. So we have a Smarty SO6 plugged in on stage 9. We have the triple pod from Max Toe. We're running the ATS stage 6 with the co pilot so in there. Hiding. And we're running the Edge Easy fuel programmer. I know it's dirty, don't roast me on it. But we're running around 500 rear wheel horse with the stock motor, stock head, stock everything else. And here's the VGT swapped on. So what you'll need to do that, you'll need to get the stock 6-7 manifold or any 6-7 manifold. And if you're a automatic guy, what's going to have to happen is you need to get this heater return line down here so that you can plug that turbo in, you can plug that line in. But on these automatic trucks, what that return does, it runs over and goes to your torque converter cooler, heat exchanger, whatever you want to call it. And that's great for really cold climates, but especially around where I live, it doesn't get cold enough for that. And if you want to do this, and you want to eliminate that torque converter cooler, you'll just get this heater core return line from a standard 6.7. And we did a little bit of fabricating and made a rubber hose to go on. You'll need this drive pressure line here. And that has to run up and you have to swap this thermostat housing with a truck that has a VGT. It's so a 2008, whatever, 2010, doesn't really matter. Other than that, everything else is really plug and play. You can see Steve's controller back there dangling that'll get cleaned up eventually but he'll send you two of these little pressure deals so one goes into the thermostat housing like it is here and one goes into your intake horn i just have mine hard rind right up there and so you'll plug into the turbo over there you run around come to his controller box and then you have to plug in two wires down on that controller down there for the truck and that's all you have to do and then it's really just plug and play so if you have a 2003 dodge you're gonna have the smaller downpipe the three and a half inch so what i did is i took the downpipe off of a 04 and a half plus which is a four inch outlet and it bolted right onto my diamond eye four inch everything worked out good but other than that that's really all for today